Welcome to the MBS Show, episode number 411. I'm your host, Norman Sanzo. And well, we have some news this week. It's all okay. But because of the pandemic, it's, it's news week has been rather slow. And life is on the slow track because of said pandemic. But let's get into the news. So... First up is Discovery Family's message to stay safe. Uh, So Discovery Family popped this message up on... uh, (laughs) Sorry. uh, uh, Popped this message up to help motivate everyone during quarantine. So uh, you can find this on the Twitters. Uh, Let's see what they have on the Twitters. And oh wow, uh, it's a video chat. Oh no, wait. Uh, this is a fan thing. Yes, no. This is the official one. Anyway, um, on Twitter, the official Discovery Family Twitter page. Uh, even villains know how to stay home, stay safe, and stay connected these days. Just make sure you dial into the right online meeting for Luna, tongue in cheek. Uh, now more than ever. Hashtag all together now. So. <laughs> In the picture, we get to see uh, T-Rex, Sombra, uh, Cozy Glow, Chrysalis, uh, Gorgar, and even Luna in a group chat thingy using the application, if I'm not mistaken, called Zoom, was it? So anyway, um, <coughs> this, is, this is cool. Like Everybody's using Zoom. I do question why, because there's Skype, there's Discord. And I heard a lot of negative things about Zoom. So, hmm. But anywho, uh, yes. Oh, <laughs> okay. Um, so, anyway, uh, so, so, yes, uh, this is cool. This this image here is cool or, or whatnot. But, oh no, Luna just accidentally dropped into a villain's chat. Oh no, how did she jump in there and stuff? Funny, tongue in cheek. Yes, uh, this is cool. And having this here is, yeah. <laughs> it's fun, it's fun. But my graphic eyes spy something that's not supposed to be there. And it's not Luna, it's technically her main. If you take a look see uh there's checker checkerboards on her main. Um there's no point in me showing it to you by pointing. You know what? I'm gonna try something new. This this should this should be fun. Uh, is the webcam right? Yes. Ah, uh, yes. I'm moving, and my finger is pointing. Okay. Um, move, move here a bit. Okay. You, you see this? Yeah. That there is what we call in Photoshop the background. Uh, when you have something transparent, you put up on the what you call this uh, layers and whatnot. So. That's not supposed to be there. That's supposed to be when you put something on the background. It's gone. It, it, it's, it's, it should not be there. But somehow in this picture here, it exists. So, um, somebody screwed up. Oh no. <coughs> but yeah, um, fun image, fun message. Yes, uh, stay home, stay connected online with your preferred method of communication. For me personally, with my group of friends online, I use Discord. Uh, Skype this <laughs> Skype is still a thing somehow, yes. And for mobile, you have the WhatsApp, you have the Facebook Messengers, and so on. Uh, you even have Telegram and Line, even WeChat. So this is all news in how you communicate with your friends. But it exists. It exists. I prefer Discord because Discord is much more... Let's just say that I'm used to it right now. And let's move on to the last news. And last news is IDW launched online store for WonderCon exclusive. So due to the COVID-19 pandemic, WonderCon is cancelled until further notice. So usually uh, what would happen here is IDW would hold stock and move it to the next convention. Uh, It could be the San Diego Comic Con or so on, whatever it is. 
But due to COVID-19 and not knowing when the next convention will pop up, um, we here, uh, sorry, IDW here has opened up a online store to, well, sell the comics. So let's see. You can go to their website, uh, link in the description, and uh, here, here, here's the mm. They have an offer here. Buy two, get one free on all Wonder Comic exclusive products. Discount will be applied automatically to the latest expensive product in cart. If all products are the same price, the discount will be applied to the last item. Uh, sales goes through April 12th. Oh no! By the time that this episode comes out, it will be... Um, yeah, let, let's just say that it's nice. It's nice news to have. So, let's go click on the link. So, I did a little bit Yeah, okay. Same thing, same thing as before. Uh, free domestic shipping on all orders above $35 and up. So, if you are in the States, eh, that's awesome. You you get free shipping. Yay! Uh, buy two, get one free. Uh, discount, blah, 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 and so on. Um, in all honesty, I would really like to, besides the ponies, um, I would really like to get the Sonic c comic and the Transformers because I, I like the c cover. The cover looks really nice. So does this one. I'm not 100% sure about this. I, I, I got no idea what's this. I, I know it's Turtles, but I, I got no idea what this is. Jenica? That's new to me. I, I haven't heard of this one before. Lock and key, haven't heard of that one. Uh, Kanto. Kanto seems to be popular. Oh, okay. But still, um, there's a lot of awesome comics here. Uh, personally, if you are a fan, uh, go get it. It's only 10 bucks, so that's cool. And if you're local, oh, that's more. Uh, if you're local, you have free shipping. So, in all honesty, you'll get the Pony Comics. You get the Transformer comics because pony covers and whatnot. And then probably you want to read something more. Uh, I heard the Transformers Terminator comic is awesome, so uh, why not get that for fun? And what else? Sonic. Yeah, Sonic's cool. With the recent Sonic movie, uh, maybe reading a lot more Sonic will be fun. So what? That'll be netting you forty bucks. So yay! Much more awesomeness to have. But anywho, that is the news for this week. So anywho, ladies and gents, uh, let's move on to the next topic. And next topic is what have I been doing with my week? So this week has been, <laughs> it's repeating the same week as before. Um, stay, uh, wake up, uh, wash up, breakfast, chores, a little bit of game. Uh, rest and repeat so there's nothing much to say nothing new okay um, if we're talking about what have I been doing other than the repeating cycle of eat sleep eat uh, eat sleep game eat sleep game I do have a few things um, Magic the Gathering uh, it's latest set uh, Ikoria is almost coming out so uh, spoiler seasons are about there's a lot of new commander exclusive cards coming out and so on so that me got me <laughs> so that got me excited and me looking at cards is awesome but the problem is the Malaysian government recently announced that the movement control order has been extended to the what was it again 28 was it Give me a second, folks. Um, yes, uh, it has been extended to the 28th. So, oh, it's official that w Malaysia has been on quote unquote lockdown for almost two months. I think, yes. Uh, we started in the end of february was it or early february march but 
uh, it's around that time. So w- some people has gone so crazy. Some people are itching to go out and do and have fun. So as for me, uh, I wish I could go to my LGS to play card games and whatnot. But due to the restriction to the movement order, I can't. So what we can do or what I did is um, get a group of my friends, got into a Google Hangout chat. I'm not 100% sure how long Google Hangout will last, but that's what we use. Anyway, uh, we got into a Google Hangout chat and we started aiming our webcams or phones or whatever it is onto our board and play card games. So, yay, it, we still have a method of playing card games. So, that's awesome. Yay. Other than that, mm, a lot of eating, a lot of trying new foods, cooking new stuff, and a lot of delivery. Uh, I, I know for some of you, uh, ordering stuff from Uber Eats, DoorDash, uh, Food Panda, Grab Food is nothing new. But you know, honestly, for me, those are foreign concepts. So getting to try it out and experience it was a lot of fun. So other than eating and that, I, I, I just remember something. Um, I started playing mobile games. My soul die a little inside. But yes, uh, I played a bit. Uh, there's one game called Golf Battle. It's on the Apple Store. I'm not 100% sure if it's on the iOS. But, sorry, um, Android Store. But it's a fun game. It's a fun game where you play miniature golf and try to be the first to finish and also the person to hit the ball less to get into the hole. Uh, other than that, I've been playing this one game called Mobile Legend Bang Bang. And f- for some of you got no idea what it is, it's a MOBA. And MOBA are a game like Dota 2 and League of Legends. And what else? Smite for some of you. So yeah, uh, I've been playing that on the mobile. It's fun. It's entertaining. It's free. And the way that they make money is through buying skins and buying accessories and whatnot. And you're probably wondering, how do they make money? All those things don't really add up. Like what, a dollar here, a dollar there. Um, Let's just say that one skin is approximately 10 bucks. And yeah, let's just say that it's annoying. It's uh, it is annoying, but that's besides the point. Um, I haven't bought anything, and I don't think I want to. Uh, that's their way of getting you in. So yeah, that's annoying. That's really annoying. But I played the game. It's a lot of fun. Uh, I'm still new at it, so I I think that's why I'm having a lot of fun. <laughs> Just wait until I get to Masters or whatever it is. Then I'll face the horror of better players than me. So, yay. So, other than that, um, eh, it's it's a game. I, I played it. So, let's wrap it up because n- nobody of you guys want to hear me blab on about what I have been playing and whatnot. So, uh, let's wrap it up. Let's wrap it up. Oh, um, if you're wondering what happened to Final Fantasy VII Remake uh, or Resident Evil 3, didn't have the money to buy those two games and technically I don't have the time to play those two games so yeah it's a bit on the depressing side I really do want to play Final Fantasy 7 Remake but uh, maybe after the quarantine where everything's more normal so anywho uh, if you guys have any questions concerns or suggestions for the show you can contact us at themissiongmail.com you can also reach us on the Twitter. The show's Twitter account is at the MBS Show. And my personal Twitter account is at Norman Sanzo. Also, please rate, uh, please subscribe and rate us on iTunes, YouTube. Don't forget to press the bell icon to stay up to date. And Stitcher Radio and also like our Facebook page. You can also catch us on PortalLive.com. Links are in the show notes. So anyway, 
uh, if you would please uh, do subscribe to the review and discussion podcast on iTunes and Stitch Radio. Over there, you'll catch me, Silver Quill, and also Totera reviewing the Pony Comics episodes and specials. Sometimes we like to do other things than comics. Uh, we like to cover anime, cartoons, comic books, movies. Uh, and as for the episode reviews, we're almost done. We are almost done with episode 9. 9, yes, episode 9. Sorry, not episode 9, season 9. So we're almost done with that. And I'm here thinking and thinking like season 10 is going to come out in comic book form. But we got no idea when it will pop out. But it'll be fun. Uh, I, I can't wait to see what comes may out of this. Uh, maybe we'll get a lot of uh, s- good stuff in the future. We, we'll see how we start reviewing that. Should we do season 10 as its own thing or part of the comic book world or whatever it is. I mean, I have to discuss with the crew and whatnot, but it will be something. So if you'd like to support the show, you can do so at patreon.com slash MBS show. With every support, you get a week's early access to the review and discussion <laughs> and discussion podcast. And uh, let's see, uh, exclusive and deleted contents. And a huge thank you from me. Talking about the thank yous, I would like to thank Lucky Knight, Amy, Tristan, and also Master of Black. Thank you so much, guys. You are great. Thank you a lot. You really mean the world to me. So anyway, I have been Norman Sanzo. And this is the MBS Show. And we'll guys catch you next week with another fun episode. See ya.